Hi, we're going to do some calligraphy here. Uh, I remember uh, it's, a, it's a little bit difficult to learn this calligraphy, and I remember I saw someone do it about 30 years ago, 35 years ago, and I was struck by how beautiful it was. I, I couldn't get my teacher to spend much time with me. He, he was too busy. And I made a personal rule that when I took notes in his class, I would take it in Tibetan in calligraphy. So I had a rule for myself, and he taught every day for sometimes five, six hours. And so my personal notes, I, I just made a self rule that I would take them in calligraphy. And, uh, and it worked. And, uh, you know, I go back and look at the early notebooks, and they look like some kid's handwriting. <laughs> and then, you know, of course, uh, practice makes perfect. So. We're going to do a little piece of calligraphy uh, from a very famous uh, yoga principle uh, because YSI is one of the 11 organizations that will be receiving free rent money from the endowment, uh, from this uh, Castle Rock endowment here. Yeah, the idea of that endowment or that money is that uh, it would help the expenses of our 11 organizations past my generation, which is Generation 100, and then you guys, Generation 101. And then, you know, I'm thinking uh, this, this uh, things that we're teaching have been going on for 100 generations. I'm one, I am literally 100, and you guys are 101. And the idea is to make the Generation 100 and the Generation 101 we just try to work extra hard, a little bit extra hard. And it's hard, and it's, it's frustrating, it's tiring. Uh, it takes energy. And, but we're going to set aside some extra funds. And then from that, uh, this business will create money. It's a very safe business. And uh, it's not going to, the place has been booked up for many years. There's a waiting list for many years. That business, which is right behind the college, so that if we need to expand the college later, we also have land. Um, we just tear down some of the rent, some of the, those rooms and make a place. So, you know, it looks like this will provide a steady income for people after we're gone. Uh, and then that will help those organizations to keep going. This calligraphy is for the purpose of fundraising. And we're going to calligraph a very special idea called Say Lung. Lung. Sem. Sem. Jupa. 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 And it's very famous and it's very appropriate to put onto a piece of calligraphy. Lung means prana, the inner wind. Sem. The mind. Jupa Chipa means they ride in tandem, like a horse and a horse rider. And the idea is sometimes you can calm your mind down by calming down your body in yoga. And then sometimes you're not feeling well in your body and you can control the problem with your mind and fix your body. So the relationship goes back and forth. And if you become a master of that, uh, you can stay healthy mentally and physically. So this is a statement about the interconnection of mind and body, okay? Which yoga helps address. So here we go, we're going to do Lung Sam Jupa Chipa. Thank you. 